Hey there, it's Stephen Pegg from Loves to Travel. Thanks for checking out our videos. As always, we appreciate you watching. Uh, heading up to Costco, but this is kind of a different Costco. But before we get into that, make sure you hit that subscribe button below if you've not done that already. Also, the bell notification button if you've uh, not done that already as well. That way you'll get notified when we put up future videos. And uh, also, we'd love for you to hit the like button too. This is kind of a different Costco. Um, it's a Costco business center. And uh, honey, I think there's only like a few of these in the country, right? Yeah, there's 17 of them in the country, according to Google. There's one of them here in Orlando. And as long as we're here, we, we want to check it out and see what it's all about. Uh, it's a Costco business center rather than a normal Costco. So uh, let's get parked and head on inside and check out what a Costco business center is all about. So this is a Costco business center. Um, and I'm not sure how much it goes with Costco, but we're going to check it out. And when we walked in, they had a coupon book, right, honey? Yeah, it's a, it's, it's got its own items. So yeah. let me check out what is it, what's in there. Yeah, it's got its own dates too. It starts on the first. Uh, where we're at started what on the on the tenth of March. That is correct. Well, let's walk around and see what a Costco business center looks like. Look at this side. Hey, we need this coffee maker, honey. That's a big old 110 cup coffee maker. Can we go through 110 cups of coffee? Probably. <laughs> yeah. On a hard morning, yes, I think so. Oh, these all these storage containers. Mm -hmm. Need saucepans, honey? Oh, that's a pro line. So these are for professionals. So yeah. I guess that's actually not a bad price for a two count eight inch fry pan. Because it is, uh, people you will use them for usually omelets. Yeah, these are these like omelet plants. Mm -hmm. Oh, those are good omelet pans too. Well, this is one of the ones that is in the ad because it's four dollars off and there are two 10 inch fry pans now the nonstick 10 inch fry pans are good but we usually tend to go through the 12 inch nonstick fry pans yeah because we cook for a lot of people 10 inches isn't big enough sometimes there's your look at that there you want you want that on your stove honey my stove is not big enough to fit that look at that do you know well, the size of the burner you need for that? Again, these are professionals, so I mean, it's like, I make jokes, but it's like true. It's like. Well, you do have your garbage bags, though, right there. They'll be on an aisle somewhere. That's just a pallet of them. Yeah, they're there, down there. So they have the uh, industrial size can liners, but they also have the kitchen bags, which is what we use at home. So those are the same ones that we use at home. Is that the same price at home? It's very similar. I had to check in my records, but that's the one we did buy four packages on our last month's sale. Yep. Oh, that's it. They have a bigger snack section. Oh, yes. Look at this. There's your Milano's, honey. They're not my Milano's. They're your Milano's. You like Milano's, too. The single can Pringles. And they've got uh, the sour cream and onion Pringles, too. And then they've got the bigger cans down there. Yeah, this, these are usually for vending machines. That's yep. why. So these are actually a really good price. And they're actually a dollar forty off, too. What are these? I've never seen these before. Oh, 
I've never seen these before. What are they? Oh, they're tortilla chips. Must be spicy. Yeah. Just something I've never seen before. There's something else on sale for oh, the, business members. Goldfish. Mm -hmm. um, my kids love these things. $2 off. Nine ninety nine. So 40 will five packs. Again, this is a Costco business center. It's not your usual Costco, but it's got a lot of your usual Costco stuff in it. Well, they do, but they tend to be bigger and they are more for businesses. Yeah. So they do have water. So that's the whole sole purpose we're here is we're here to buy water. Yeah. About the only thing we're going to buy here. I'm not taking it back to back home with us. Hey, you need vegetable oil? There's the big one. This is this place is huge. I'd say this is twice the size of our Costco, would you say? Or or at least half again as big. Well, we got to check the price of soda. That's what we always check, remember? Yeah. yeah. Soda's going to be down this aisle. Ooh, 10 fourth. That's comparable. 10.79 for Pepsi. Pepsi's what? 11. No, Pepsi is about right. Pepsi's about right. That's comparable. The Diet Coke, we know the prices of Diet Coke. That's yeah, that's on the other next okay. aisle over. Right here on the end, yeah. Yeah, Diet Coke's more 12.29. Coke and Diet Coke are more expensive. And I don't believe, correct me if I'm wrong, I don't believe there is a deposit or a recycle fee here uh, in Florida. I know there is in Michigan, and there's not one in Indiana, but I don't think there's one here. Yeah, 11, wow, Coke Zero is cheaper than regular Coke and Diet Coke. Those are the bottles. Ten ninety nine, or you can get the big old bottles, the four pack of the uh, two liter bottles for five ninety nine. Not bad price; they're comparable to home, maybe a little bit more. They are fully stocked on toilet paper and paper towels. One thing I will say at our condo, and I'm not going to say which one it is that we're at, because we're like, we've had like three of them that we're staying at this, this well, trip. Well, we're checking in, checking out, and Just testing, check uh, checking them out. I'm going to suggest that if you're going to stay in a condo, though, you might want to bring your own toilet paper. Just saying. <laughs> it's, it's, not, it's not that they don't give you toilet paper. It's just that it's the cheapest they can get their hands on. We found out that out the, the hard way. Um, water you wanted to get, right? That's pretty much the same price, two ninety nine. That is the same price as it is where we're at. Yeah. So you want to get a water thing, right? Mm -hmm. One thing we do go through a lot is water. Do we drink a lot of water? The reason we drink water when we travel is because each area has a different purification system. Yep. And some waters do taste funny, but there's some things left in each one, even though the water, they say, is completely purified. If you're not used to the water, you could have issues. Right. And we've noticed that when we travel and when we moved cross country multiple times, is that we will always get sick a couple days after we move to a new location. Right. So we bring our own water just because you don't know, the tap water should be fine, don't get me wrong, but if you're not used to what's in the tap water, it could affect you, if you know what I mean. If you've heard of Montezuma's Revenge, you know what I'm talking about. This is a huge cooler. Look at the way they've got the meat. Uh, when, was last, when have you ever seen meat displayed like this? Four packs, seven packs. That's not bad. That's not a 
the highest total. Yeah, I'm not going to get those, though. Not bad. Not a bad price, but... Do they have your bacon? Okay. Or, yes, they do, actually. Oh. Oh. We've been looking for this oh in our Costco. Oh, gosh. Oh, for I'm so eight. sad. We've been looking for this since the beginning of the pandemic. And they have it here. Now, we have seen comments on our on our page that people have seen it in other Costco, so hopefully we'll start getting it in our Costco again soon. But the regular bacon's not bad. It's just a little salty for us. But we like this lower salt bacon. I'm glad I wore a hoodie in here. That's oat milk. It's on sale, $1.50 off. Have you ever tried oat milk? I know our grandson loves it. Is it oat milk or nut milk that he, he likes? He likes oat milk, but he only likes oat milk from Trader Joe's. I'm not going to stay in here much longer. It's cold. There's your cheese, string cheese. I see they have a lot of items that you'd normally buy at your normal Costco, including ham. There's your ham up there. Oh, that's turkey ham. But the other ham, our ham is down there, the Kirkland ham. And they have a whole fruit and vegetable section down here too. But it's all in one big cooler. Okay, we just went through the refrigerated, the whole giant refrigerated case, but they do have separate freezer aisles because they don't want you walking through a freezer. I'm just looking for things that are on sale. There's a lot of bread. So again, you could use this as your regular Costco because they have all the regular Costco items. Good price for bagel bites. Kids love bagel bites. There's your pot stickers you don't like. That's the chicken. I love beef, uh, beef pot stickers. I'll tell you the beef pot stickers I like are the ones from uh, Trader Joe's. Oh, this is interesting. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Those are beef. Okay. You like pork pot stickers from Trader Joe's, yeah, not true. pot yeah, stickers. Yeah, pork pot stickers. They said something's interesting. We said that Marie Callender's pies were on sale at the regular Costco. Mm -hmm. It's on sale now. At three fifty off, six forty nine. Great price. So you're going to get eight. That's less than a dollar. That's way less than a dollar per piece. This is yeah. priced really well. Great price for pop chicken pot pies. Do you want to buy them? No. Yes. You, you want to get them? Yes. Are we going to go through these? We'll go through them while we can feed our guests. Yeah, that's them. true. Or take them to their house. That is, if you think about that, is a yeah. great price. Yeah. And these are really good, too. Six dollars off that. It's not a bad price. They have a lot more fish. Yeah, I see that. They got tilapia. You like tilapia. Atlantic cod is down there. They have flounder. Flounder. Right oh there. my gosh, what was the last time we had flounder? Flounder. They have uh, Alaska cod. 
they have mahi mahi. That's a really good price too. Yeah, three dollar instant rebates. That's actually a really good price because that's a pound and a half. I can eat that. That is doable. Well, we're not getting it, are we? It is, it we're only cool. here for a couple more days. Okay. They have mahi mahi. Calamari? Calamari steaks. Then wild calamari. You go crazy in here. You you love fish. You love seafood. I know where I'm coming in October. First thing first, right? When we get here. Mm -hmm. Look at all the shrimp. What is boom boom shrimp? Oh, it's gluten free. Really? Mm -hmm. Wow. Lamb racks, lamb chops. Really? New Zealand lamb, four shanks. Four shanks. Mm. That's right. Very unique. Wait till you see what's right here at the end of the aisle. We've had that. Yeah, we've been through there. That's whole lamb. Mm -hmm. And then right here, they have uh, bone and goat cubes. And right above that international. Goat cut six ways. They got a lot of things that they don't have at our Costco, I'll tell you that. They have duck. Random weight duck 319. Cornish game hens. A lot of chicken. They don't have a fresh deli. That's what they don't have. Yeah. They don't know how the rotisserie chicken. At least we haven't found it yet, so. Chicken nuggets. We've had these. These are really good. Yeah, those are good. And they're on sale. Wings. They have the Beyond Burger, the plant-based Beyond Burgers here. I've never tried one. I will eventually sometime. And you've got all your burger stuff. My kid, we used to get these all the time. They used ground sirloin. Um, did we get these or we, we got the ground the ground beef patties. The... You know, what was so funny was when we were at um, Publix. And a four-pack of fresh hamburger was twelve ninety nine. dollars Four-pack. A four-pack. I could buy six pounds for a little bit more than that. Yeah. They're frozen though, but we used to get those all the time. Uh, if you like uh, sweet potato fries, those are on sale here, five dollars off. But you got to get the big box of them. The six 2.5 ounce boxes inside that big box. Same thing with hash browns and straight cut fries. Oh no, straight cut fries aren't on the deal, but hash browns, hash browns are. Two fifty off hash browns. They have your tea, honey. They have your tea. They have an organic version of the same thing. Oh, that's new. I have not seen that one. I just have just the regular tea. But you like that green tea. Do you want me to get some? No, we can't take it home. That's... You know how much stuff we've already bought? Yeah, that's true. We've kind of overspent already. Hot chocolate hot? cocoa bombs. Chocolate cocoa bombs? Yeah. Honey, it's hot cocoa. It's hot cocoa chocolate bombs. Or hot cocoa bombs. How does that work? They're different flavors. But how does it work? You just put them in a cup and put hot water on them? I guess. Yeah. Six. Oh, they do. Oh. Oh. Remember, you just basically pour, and then it melts and goes in. Okay. Remember, it's very similar to the, um, when you do, when you put 
what is it when they melt a dessert oh okay and then it melts over and it opens up it's inside okay the marshmallows are inside and yeah. the chocolate is on the outside so the marshmallows are inside the ball and then when you pour hot water in it melts and yep cool so it comes in four flavors i like that idea mm -hmm. we might have to look and see if they've got them in our home costco let me try them out Coffee's on sale here now. Our coffee is. The Folgers. It's two dollars off. That's normally what we pay for it up there. That is about right. Yeah. And the prices are real close to being similar. Most of those aisles are pretty much the same as ours. We got this at, uh, what was it, uh, Disney. Oh, we should buy this for our friend that's coming over. She loves us. That's not bad. Uh -huh, let's buy that. All right. Be a present to them. We have a friend that lives in Melbourne. That she loves these things. Be kind of a present to her. I want to see if they've got that, is it Rayo? I guess somebody said it's pronounced Rayo. The, the sauce and the soups. See if they have that here. There's Prego. Well, they told me it was pronounced, I think in their comments, it was pronounced Rayo. So I want to see if they have that, because we've not been able to find it in our Costco. And they don't have the spaghetti sauce. They don't have the sauce. Let's check the soups real quick. This way. I don't see it. This is all ramen, though. Yeah, it's, it's funny. Ramen is considered a soup, and it's usually in a soup section. Yeah. Get on that last dial there and see if it's there. That's not expensive. Oh, the udon? Mm -hmm. Is that same price or more expensive? $2 more than where we are in our area. Yeah, my son loves udon. Excuse me. I have the feeling we're not going to find it. Nope. That's all right. I'll go down to the end of the aisle here and head down to the front of the store. At uh, Rayo's of uh, soups and uh, and sauces and such. All right. Now we know. Let's go up to the front and see what else is here. Right, here's some more uh, industrial strength stuff. Oh, these are the packing for the containers. Yep. So, for example, if you're getting something to go, there you go. They have steam pans for... Uh, Oh, 
parties. Yeah, parties. Thank you. <laughs> Need some foil, honey? There's a big thing of foil right there. That's a lot of foil. Well, it's actually priced really well. It's, it really is, but that's a lot of foil. Now, here's your normal Reynolds wrap. Is that yeah, that's Reynolds wrap. Because that's 750 feet for $23.99. Yeah. And this is only, this is 500 feet. Well, it is priced really similar, almost. Or you can get the, uh, 300 feet right but next to it for $14.99. But those are the bigger sizes. Uh, you want to go down snacks again? Mm -hmm. Rice Krispie Treats. Yep. They have Pop-Tarts. Your flavor? By uh, themselves? Yeah, they do, actually. They do! Which kind of surprises me because ours only has the mixed. But they have the uh, cinnamon brown sugar and also the strawberry by themselves. And then the mix, which our Costco only has the mix. What's our pricing at Pop Tarts usually? $6.99. Uh, that's about the same price. At uh, Sam's. Yeah, at Sam's Club, yeah. So we could move down here. You could get your Pop Tarts. Yeah. We don't have this. Yeah, we do not have this. Black Forest gummy bears. So when I was pregnant with my very first child. <laughs> yes. Do we want to talk about that? How many gummy bears you went through? One night, I had a craving for gummy bears. I ate all the Halloween candy that I was giving out that night. Mm -hmm. Plus, I ate gummy bears. Mm -hmm. We talked about not a little, probably a pound of two of gummy bears yep. and all the Halloween candy because I had a craving. Yep. I ended up giving away change. Yep. That's what I ended up doing. Yep. Because I ate all the Halloween candy. Now I will say too, I mean this is the Black Forest gummy bears. There's a gummy bear factory near us that we're actually going to do a tour of sometime this uh, summer. Um, what about an hour and a half away from us? Uh, what is it? Uh, Albanese? Uh, Albanese. Albanese, yeah. And it's uh, just, it's about an hour and a half away from us. So I think that we're going to actually go up there and do it. They do tours, or if they don't do tours, at least get a film of it um, and uh, get some gummy bears. So, but they actually make them about an hour and a half from us. Feel the sensation. York peppermint patties. My youngest boy loves York peppermint patties. So wrapping things up here at the Costco Business Center, again, this is something we've never been to. And as Peg said, there's like, what, 17 in the country or 27 in the country? Yes, uh, according to Google, right now there's 17 in the country, but they may change. It's uh, much like our Costco, but it's kind of set up a little bit differently, obviously with a humongous freezer for all of it. I've never seen meat displayed like that before, but basically for businesses like convenience stores and things like that to come in and get their supplies. Uh, there was a lot of people in there shopping for businesses. Um, not a lot of people in there, kind of like us, you know, just personally shopping. But but you can. Your Costco, your Costco card is going to get you in here, just like it would your normal Costco. A couple of things we noticed. Uh, no cart corrals out in the parking lots. Uh, there are no cart corrals. In the, well, I guess there is one on the way in the, way in the back, um, but not up close to the store. Um, and then I didn't see anybody wiping down carts as, as, as we were getting the carts, but they may have been doing that when they stack them and you just don't see it. So I'm not sure about that, but we wipe our own carts down anyway. Uh, anything else you noticed, hon? Um, there's no deli area. Oh, that's right. Yeah. No, uh, rotisserie chicken, no deli area. Uh, you don't, you know, you can't buy yourself like we do at our Costco, the uh, pre-mixed Caesar salad. There's no real meat department there. It's all prepackaged stuff that you buy in that big, uh, big refrigerated section of the store. Uh, anything else you wanted to talk about? There was more snacks. Oh yeah, yeah, more snacks, a lot more snacks, but a lot more snacks packaged for businesses, for example, to sell at convenience stores or to put into vending machines.
But they did have something that our Costco did not have. And that would be? Your? Pop-Tarts. And lower salt bacon. They had lower salt bacon, which we've been trying to find for months. It hasn't been at our Costco. We've seen some comments from people that they've seen it at their Costco. We have not seen it at ours yet. Uh, but they had it here, lower salt bacon. So maybe it is finally starting to come back. So thanks for watching the video. We do appreciate it. If you've not hit the subscribe button below, love for you to do so. Also that bell notification button below. That way you'll get notified when we put up future videos. And as far as that like button, if you hit that, you're going to help us out immensely. So please hit the like button too. Thanks for watching.